everyone sneaking in. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. To those of you who are joining us, inshallah, on Facebook, on uh, Amagra 360, and on YouTube, welcome to this very unique, very strange live session. Uh, if you guys want to guess where I'm coming in from and what's going on, you're welcome to do so. And as you can see from the title, Alhamdulillah, today we're being joined by a very special guest, Sheikh Yahya Ibrahim. Feel free to tag uh, your friends and your families and your loved ones. I see a lot of people are sneaking in. Welcome, welcome. Hopefully the snow still allows you to see me as best as possible. Um, how is everyone doing today? And welcome. I see more people. a couple more people have joined. Feel free to say your salams and join in, inshallah, in the conversation. And I'll see, I'll shout out any of you that I see already. Oh, I see Sheikh Ammar's session coming in from my computer already. Alhamdulillah. Have, is anyone here who is earlier joining us with Sheikh Ammar Shukri? Welcome, Sam. It's a pleasure to see your name again. Alhamdulillah. And no guesses so far in terms of what we're, where we're at and what we're doing. I was actually just flexing on our special guest today. Sheikh Yahya is joining us for just a couple of minutes uh, about one of our newest projects, one of our most exciting projects that uh, Amal Group has just launched uh, and is looking to get your support for, which is, of course, Amal Group Kids. As you guys know, today's a really big day. It's Amal Group, uh, it's not Amal Group Tuesday, it's Giving Tuesday on Facebook and Launch Good. And you guys have been super amazing and generous in supporting our campaign. Um, it's an exciting and nerve wracking journey that we're going on. And uh, we're really very grateful to have Sheikh Yahya with us just for a little bit. Uh, say your salams in the chat to him as we uh, have him for a couple minutes just to give us a couple of reminders and to speak about the amazing uh, Amal Group Kids campaign that we have going on. I myself am just outside of my house flexing on the Sheikh because this is our weather right now. And assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah Sheikh. I don't know if you can show us what's happening outside your window. <laughs> no, you alhamdulillah. We're, uh, I'm, I'm just gonna enjoy 30 degree heat here in, in, in Perth today, mashallah. So uh, alhamdulillah. But I hope you enjoy the snow. I actually miss the snow a lot. And it's the first winter, uh, your winter, our summer, that the family and I are not going to have snow. We're usually in the snow. <laughs> but due to travel restrictions, inshallah khair. So you're was... actually testing us quite a bit with your snow there. I'm tempting you with this, Sheikh. Are you sure about that? Yeah, um... absolutely. SubhanAllah. I heard, so I was just speaking to an Australian earlier as people are trickling in and coming through, uh, that there's parts of Australia that do get snow apparently, or it just gets really, really cold. Yeah, up in the mountainy kind of areas in Victoria, it does okay. get a little bit of snow. Mount Threadbow and other places where, you know, if you want to ski, you can find. It is a little bit out of the way, though. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. SubhanAllah, it's just is it what's well, our blessings are our, our tests are your blessings and your your blessings are our tests. So uh, may Allah make it easy for all of us. But I wanted to bring you on here to discuss uh, something that's been super exciting. It's been super new as well. It's something that uh, Al Maghrib is working on for over two years. A few of you have been teased about it and have uh, kind of shown your enthusiasm. But uh, Sheikh, I know you work like intensely within the community, within all facets of the community uh, and as well with children as well. Uh, do you have any uh, kind of first initial thoughts or reflections on the fact that Al-Maghrib is bringing in a kids program? Um, and what would you like to see from us? Yeah, Al-Maghrib Kids is going to be awesome. Uh, I can't wait to get my kids enrolled in it. Uh, even though, you know, I'm a teacher and I'm, uh, you know, I, uh, I'm a manager at, um, and it, uh, you know, a thriving Islamic school here in Australia. We got a thousand plus kids. I can tell you it is something that is going to be um, revolutionary. Uh, online Islamic education is very important. It's something that uh, I kind of jumped into when the whole COVID thing happened just to, to be able to provide some assistance. But for somebody uh, as Al Maghrib, as professional as they are, as um, diverse in their instructor group, as um, well seasoned and experienced, I can only say that I really look forward to working. Um, uh, you know, in this project, and, and, and I will give it my full support. So I'm very happy to donate personally for it, for my financial support. It's something that I look forward for my children, for my students at the school to become active members and part of. Uh, <laughs> and I believe it is a new frontier. Uh, we're probably uh, maybe two years 
behind where I'd like us to be at Al Maghrib. But Alhamdulillah, it's better late than never. And one of the things that I've always known with Al Maghrib is that they like to get the plan set and the methodology right, the uh, pedagogy right, and then move forward with it. So it's really uh, a new day. And mashallah, whether snow or sunshine, I think it's going to bring uh, it's going to bring uh, baraka, inshallah. That was cheeky right there, Shay. <laughs> yeah, but subhanallah, I, I agree with you 100. percent Alhamdulillah. You know what's what's strange? I was thinking earlier about the fact that not even just kids programming being lacking in the community and their identity and their confidence within faith being much more challenged in modern times. I'm sure the pandemic has a whole different uh, kind of role in this and the fact that, yes, kids are able to go to maybe their schools here and there within restrictions, but the masajid, the, the programs, the weekend programs, Islamic schools, all that kind of stuff, uh, either it's online and it's not the same effect as, you know, for example, Islamic schools are maybe, you know, difficult, working in with different circumstances as well, but they've lost that sense of community with other Muslim kids and adults watching from them, learning from them. Everything online is a lot harder, uh, I'm sure, than it has been in the past. So having a focused, you know, fo you know, geared program towards their experiences to get the, to build their confidence, to entertain them in a way that they don't have to be forced to stare at the screen and to sit with their parents is going to be a whole new experience. And you're right, Alhamdulillah, I know we're a little bit behind in the in the game, but uh, what we love to do at Al-Maghrib is when we do crowdfund and we ask for support for a new program, it's something that we want it to be, to be a legacy that we carry on for a long time. Alhamdulillah, we've had Faith Essential, we've had Quran Revolution, Faith IQ, like you mentioned. So Alhamdulillah, uh, we don't want this to be just a temporary project. This is something that we're going to put our hearts and our souls and everything else into. Uh, so I'm really excited that we have. The and that's what shows the urgency in it. Yeah. It does show the urgency of saying, look, we need this now. It, it needs to come about. And, you know, nobody knew in hindsight, if I, I believe if any of us knew that uh, COVID and the restrictions were coming, this would have been, you know, uh, project number one. Exactly. But it wasn't something that you know you could see coming into reality but subhanallah uh it is the qadr of allah azza wa jal the plans are there but the execution of it now is the right time and that's why um you know i was on my way for for my morning um walk and run and uh you know when i got the message hey it's um you know it's what is it uh, tuesday something tuesday. the special tuesday yeah. on facebook yeah, Giving Tuesday, exactly. I thought, well, look, this is, you know, Tuesday gives what whatever you donate back in, in, uh, along with it. So that's a really incredible opportunity. <laughs> so I said, yes, uh, put me online. I'd love to speak to people directly and let them know this is something that I wholeheartedly support. It is something that will bring uh, a, a whole revolutionary um, uh uh, realm to online Islamic education and Maghrib does it right and does it right for many good reasons uh, not just the caliber of instructors and the, the detail of the programs but uh, just you know the experience of the online uh, marketing and, and, and um, uh, delivery of the program is going to be uh, beyond what anybody else is, is capable of doing including um, those who are local Islamic centers or schools. It's something that's going to become a very, very useful tool um, in the fight against ignorance and in motivating our children to do what's good and, and to learn what's good, inshallah. Beautiful. Shit. I couldn't have said it better. Jazakallah khair for giving us this uh, motivation as well. I know the links are already in the description for those of you who've been tuning in and benefiting from the last few minutes with us and the Sheikh. Sheikh, I'm not going to steal too much of your lovely, bright Sunday morning. And it looks like I'm losing most of my day. So inshallah, thank you so much for always being there to support the, the da'wah and may Allah reward you and give you a, a great piece of this ajariya that you're contributing to today um, and, and with everyone else who is contributing. Inshallah, I mean, we'll see you soon, Sheikh. Uh, thank you so much for blessing us with your presence. And we'll see you and for those, those of you who are still here, um, I'm so excited that you guys were the first. Oh, dang, it got quite dark. You were the first to benefit from this. Uh, one, some of the first from this amazing announcement. And you still have time. It looks dark and dreary from my end. But Alhamdulillah, you have so much opportunity to share in this uh, experience and to share in this uh, khair by contributing to the Giving Tuesday campaign for the new frontier of Al-Maghrib, which is including Al-Maghrib Kids, one of our most ambitious projects that we've ever come up with. Alhamdulillah, we've mastered and 
we've pioneered uh, the adult education realm when it comes to Islamic education. Now we're going to bring some of those same strengths and those same lessons to the child education realm and make sure that we gear our, our focus and our efforts, inshallah. Uh, the, the kids program is focused on kids from the ages of 8 to 13. I know that was a question I just missed. Uh, then I hope that inshallah you guys will support generously. If you have any questions, feel free to message us on Facebook and the link is in the description for the Facebook uh, Giving Tuesday camp. Jazakum Allah everyone for joining us. Apologies for the loss of light, but we're so blessed to have you with us as always. And I'll see you soon. Take care. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.